Hi, do you know the starting salary of a Tableau developer? It can go around 6 LPA to 10 LPA and the median salary range for this profile is around 22 LPA. So let's talk about what is a Tableau developer. The Tableau developer, which is also known as CRM analytics developer, is someone who design and code and create dashboard reports and visualization chart in the software called Tableau. So it's a visualization software which is used for specifically creating visual presentation of your data. So data is present in charts and graphs and all the colorful presentation you can see it in Tableau. If you were unaware of the fact that Tableau is a CRM software which was powered by Salesforce, so here it is, you can now be aware of the fact that Tableau is completely a CRM software which is also known as CRM analytics developer software. So if you want to become a CRM analytics developer, let's know about what is CRM analytics development. CRM is customer relationship management. Analytics is obviously how you visualize the data, how you gather the data and how you present it. And development is presenting the data in designing the data and configuring the data. And in this video, I'm going to be telling you about the exact roadmap of how you can become a Tableau developer or let's say CRM analytics developer in uh, 2025 in just one month of preparation. So this video will be a whole idea of how you can start from Tableau journey and how exactly you can find jobs in them. So in this software, what you have to do is you bring out certain data from external software or either Salesforce CRM itself and put it in the CRM analytics studio and you try to visualize those data. You have to present those data in the format that is very visually appealing for someone who is non from a non-tech background. For example, if a salesperson comes and they present a certain data in a descriptive manner, they are trying to describe you certain thing and there is another person B and who is a CRM analytics developer who is trying to present the same data in the form of something that is very visually appealing to a person who is from a non-tech background. So these are two scenarios wherein you can know what exactly is the requirement of this profile. In the industries, we have around large chunks of data which could not be visualized or thought analytically if you cannot present the same data in the format that is very much visually appealing to a certain group of people. Here is why the importance of such roles is going to increase in the future and it's going to be really much in demand in the year of 25. If you have knowledge of a BI tool and if the BI tool is trending, for example, if you are learning Power BI development, or Adobe Analytics development or let's say Google Analytics development. You will not worry on how to switch jobs. And if you're thinking wherein you can study all of these Tableau. So Salesforce is an open source site wherein you can practice all of these things. But I'm going to link all of the study material. What you can do is go on the trailhead and search for CRM Analytics development. Therein you will see a module called CRM Analytics and you have to go through each and every trails of it and you have to practice it on the Salesforce CRM analytics software itself and you have to create your own personal account over there wherein you can practice all of these visualization charts, graphs. This is going to be a really fun when you just interact with the trailhead platform. You will know that there are multiple things that you can learn over there just for free. You don't have to pay anything over there and yeah, you can follow along all the trails of CRM analytics and please let me know in the comment section below if you stuck at any point. So once you're done with the trailhead modules, I would highly encourage you to spend some money in gathering the certification for CRM analytics developer and how you can do that, you can create a profile on WebSSR and herein you can see all of the certification that are present for the Tableau profile or let's say CRM analytics development profile and you have to go through the certification cost would be around $200 but if you spend such money on certification that is that holds a high credibility I would say that you will be on a right place in 2025. Once you're done with your certification the next step would be to find jobs but before that I would encourage you to create a project solely dependent on the Tableau CRM so yes do create a project if you are not aware of how you can create it you can refer the Salesforce project you can search in the search box that projects that includes Tableau CRM so therein you will find all the projects that are already present and you can try to imitate such project and you can put it in the resume. Your resume would look really great. Talking about those job search, I can say that you have to network on LinkedIn. You have to follow all the recruiters that are hiring for CRM analytics developer role and therein you will find your way and optimize your LinkedIn profile. Put all the necessary details that are already in your profile and that are really needed to become a CRM analytics developer. Mention all the skills 
that are crucial for example if you really want to become a crm developer mention that you know dax querying also you can mention that you know how to handle saql how to work on sql things so that way you when a recruiter searches on its own they will find your profile easily also another way is to ask for a referral from your one of the connections who is hiring or whose company is hiring so if you ask for a referral there is high chance that you will get that interview call for the role of tableau developer yes you can create a live portfolio for uh, this uh, tool if you practice it so well create a portfolio and send it to all the recruiters that you think are going to hire for tableau developer so make a target of applying 10 jobs every day at least 10 jobs on linkedin every day and optimize your nokri profile as well because the chances of getting an an interview call is higher from nokri rather than from linkedin if you have created a profile on crm analytics development platform then there you will realize you don't need to have anything you can practice on your own tableau public platform is completely free and you have to put in a data set and start working on it you can do the time series the bindings the groupings everything on the same platform and you are going to love it if you are someone who is really so much into reporting and dashboard this is your thing because that is all a data analytics thing called tableau development or crm analytics development so if you have any query suggestion or doubt relating to this profile you can write it in the comment section below i would answer all the queries that you have in your mind and if you are still worried of which way to go i would ask you to pick this direction because crm is booming itself so anyone who is a part of crm they will be there in 25 and they are going to grow so yeah bye for now until we meet next time